Hey wizard, so got something pretty cool to show you here. I'm gonna head over to some code and just run python3 main.py to run a dy dx script. And as soon as I do that, you'll see that it will start trading on dy dx. Now, right now I'm on testnet, but this works in production as well for mainnet. And I'm gonna hit portfolio and you can see it's already opening a position here. So here's a pair that it's just opened. If I flip back here, you'll see trade status live. Um, it's now found basically two pairs to trade. And this is using all the same stuff as we spoke about here with Crypto Wizards, except it's automating the trading and doing it on DYDX. Now, the reason I'm choosing DYDX is for a number, number of reasons. Number one, I get emailed about it a lot and understandably, it's a really good platform, it's decentralized. Number two, we need to rely less on centralized exchanges for obvious reasons. Number three, DYDX is actually really complex from an API perspective, or at least it is until you know what works and how to get it to work. And so as per request, I will be doing a course. It'll be a brief course. I say brief, usually my courses are like 15 hours long, but on how to code a bot start to finish with DYDX. But I really think there were some areas on the last statistical arbitrage course on Udemy that fell short where what I want to do is get something up here, which will number one, show you how to also run your bot in the cloud, but also enable you to manage alerts, right? So if something goes wrong, if your bot stops running or whatever, it will actually just ping you and tell you, hey, your bots, there's a problem. Something didn't go as expected so that you can act on that because whether it's your code or whether it's something that went wrong uh, in trading on the exchange, both are very likely to happen. You need to be notified, etc. too. So this will use pairs trading. It will use statistical arbitrage because if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Like that's what we're going to do. And I'm hoping that that will answer a lot of questions and take away a lot of headaches. Um, finally, thanks to everyone who's supporting Crypto Wizards, who signed up, who's using the tool. Definitely, we're gaining momentum in terms of what works, what doesn't. In terms of the portfolio tracking, etc., that is still being developed and worked on at the moment. The issue with that is just time, right? So that's going to take longer. It's undergoing testing. Um, there's a lot more work that needs to be done on that. So I'm not ready to show you anything on that yet. I am still hoping, fingers crossed, that by the end of the month, uh, we will have some kind of forward testing portfolio tracking on that but I'd rather ship something that's great than just ship something quickly for the sake of shipping it quickly. So that's the final thing there. Otherwise, I hope you're all doing well. Hope you're all looking forward to the Christmas holidays, if you're having Christmas holidays, etc. And until the next one, take care. Talk soon.